For all of you out there, be very careful when using teal. It is a wonderful color, not made for the border of your shower. Respect the teal. Welcome to another episode of Designer Reacts. Hi, I'm Bregan Jane. I like what I like. You guys like doing what you like doing, and I like judging you doing it. So let's see what happens today when you do your bathrooms. That's not a good idea, bro. Just, just, maybe he doesn't want seven years of bad luck. I just kind of went up there, pulled it. I uh, probably might want to... Barehanded, by the way. Like, what if that would have broke? Yeah, he's super lucky because this mirror wasn't attached well. Most of your bathroom mirrors are actually put on with a crazy black adhesive that's almost like tar. So I do not recommend removing a mirror the way he tried. And if you're gonna do it, use gloves. This bathroom's already been remodeled. How do I know? The paint isn't behind the mirror. You know, the wife and I always thought this was kind of a nice decorative piece until I took it off. They were covering up a hole. Seriously. Okay, if you're gonna call people out on your mistakes, then you better not be making them in this video. Where are those outlets different heights? This is what happens when you remodel on a remodel on a remodel on a remodel. Anytime you're dealing with plumbing, make sure the water's off. So go put it out on your front lawn and then just pray that night that someone comes and takes it. Are you in Texas? Wait, wait, wait. I want the hidden cam on who came and got that sick. Please turn the power off or don't do electrical yourself if you're not an electrician. Just gonna put that out there for all of you. Yes, they teach you that when you go to school to become an electrician, not when you buy a house as a homeowner, so it's okay if you call somebody in to do that for you. Why? Why? You're updating a fixture. Update it. This is not updated. In movies in the late 80s, early 90s, when they were in a fancy house, this is the light they had. So of course, what do we gotta do? We gotta do unpermanent electrical work. Not recommended for you at home. Everyone's obsessed with seafoam green this year. Do you think he picked that up from somebody else's lawn? The drain did not match up with the old one. At this point, I've already hired a plumber. We'll end the video right about here and just show you a couple shots of what it ended. Gray, white, and a touch of gold. Can't go wrong with me. It's plain-ish, but it's non-offensive, and I appreciate that. An 11-minute video on a bathroom remodel might cure your insomnia. Plain and simple is never that offensive. Clear your mind and watch this and drift off to sleep. <sighs> okay, I'm awake again. Let's see what we have next. Mike, I feel like I've seen you again, or there's just a theme going on here in the Renault world. We're gonna be turning it from this into this. Hmm, hmm. I get very judgmental when you use teal. I don't hate it, I don't hate it. I'm, I'm not gonna be able to see past this. He painted the frame teal, and I'm having mixed emotions about this because it's my favorite color, and I like that he's modernized it, but I don't know if it's the best use of teal. I think he should have gone black. But let me focus on the rest of what's happening in this video. DIY bathroom renovation in a weekend, but you're starting on Friday. Cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater. Remember when I said I got done with all the dirty work? This is why you want to renovate your bathroom. Seriously, mold can really make you sick. Like you guys, when you know it's time to redo your bathroom, just call me. This works really well, but if you My favorite color. Refinishing a tub is a good idea. I think doing it yourself is a lot. Also, I don't know why he's not replacing the fixtures inside the shower, but do you, bro? Yeah, just hire somebody to do that part. They literally like companies who just do this for apartment buildings over and over and over and over again, and they do a great job, they know how to do it, and they get it done fast for cheap. I feel like it's gonna take me a weekend to watch this video. This is why your boyfriend never calls you on the weekends. I feel like this looks like the back of like a beer pong table. Like what? What is pegboard doing in a bathroom? Oh, Watch see, out. it doesn't even want to be there. It's just a dude, it's not his fault. I think it reminds him of a skateboard deck. I know this girl, she is a designer, and I guarantee she is about to throw down some knowledge. It's so cute. Okay, when your girlfriend says, I think it's so cute, it's not really a compliment. Rachel was like, no, don't tag me in this, but I saw you, girl. For all of you out there, be very careful when using teal. It is a wonderful color, not made for the border of your shower. Respect the teal. This is the perfect use of color in the wrong area. You could make the walls a very beautiful teal and pop like some matte black hardware in this bathroom and it's going to look more elevated. This teal just is not going to wear well in the utility of this bathroom. I like the above counter black ceramic sink. That's what I like about this video. Probably not going to follow you. 
Sorry. If you're gonna deliver an after to me and you want me to take you seriously, don't do it from your squatty potty. The one big thing that I was unable to complete before the weekend was up is the plumbing. Then how is it a bathroom makeover? Not really interested in seeing you anymore. You get a solid C minus. You ruined teal. By the way, Rachel is an amazing designer and next time just hand over your tools. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Designer Reacts. I'm gonna go take a nap now. Those videos were very, way, way too long. But I don't want you to become a victim of anyone else's design leftovers. So make sure you follow me at Brigan Jane across all social. And for next week's episode, please click to subscribe. Somewhere here. <laughs>